Hello guys, this is Amos Doll Music, and in today's lesson, I want to teach you how to play this new anime opening song. It's called History Maker. Okay, so I'm going to teach you the catchy chorus. Okay, so I'll give you a preview before we start learning how to play this. Okay, so it goes like this. Like that, okay? So, let's get started learning this chorus, okay? So the right hand starts on the E, middle C is here, we go up an octave C, and then we have the E, okay? So it goes E, and then down to B, and then up to E, F sharp, B. E. And then, it goes B, F sharp, E, F sharp. Okay, that's the first part, okay? For the right hand. Let's do it again, so this first part goes E, down to B, up to E, F sharp, E, and then B, F sharp, E, F sharp. Okay, that's the right hand. Left hand, it's two chords, is A major, A, C sharp, E, and then C sharp minor, which is C sharp, E, G sharp. These two chords, okay? With those two chords in mind, A major and C sharp minor, let's put the two hands together. Okay, so for this first part, both hands goes like this. E and A major together. After the E, C sharp minor by itself, right comes in. Like that. That's the first part. Let's do it again. So it goes together. Here. Like that. Okay, make sure you count 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 in this because this is actually in um, we'll put it 6 8 time. Because like 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, like that. Okay, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3. Etc. Okay, so yeah, may, pay attention to that because when I first like listened to the song, I was like, wait a second. Even though at the start it's a really steady beat, but it's still in six eight time. Okay, because there's actually six uh, distinct beats in each kind of like phrase. Okay, but anyway, so that's the first part. Right hand for the second part. Right hand goes F sharp, and then F sharp E, F sharp E, F sharp A, G sharp E, like that. Okay, that's the right hand for the second part. Let's do it again. The right hand second part goes like this. F sharp, F sharp, E, F sharp, E, F sharp, A, G sharp, E. That's the right hand, okay? So, the left hand for the second part is just two B major chords. B, D sharp, F sharp, and the B major chord again, okay? Easy like that, okay? So with that in mind, let's put the hands together for this second part. F sharp and B major together. One, two, three. And F sharp and B major together. Okay, let's do it again. So the second part goes together. Two, three, four, five, six, like that. Okay, that's the second part. Okay, and moving on to the third part of this chorus, right hand, it goes like this. It's similar, it goes, right hand goes B, E, F sharp, E, and then another E, and here is B, F sharp, E, F sharp, like that. Okay, so in essence, the right hand is sort of similar to the first part, but just uh, kind of like extra notes and stuff, take away and get, give away, okay? So let's do it again. So, B, E, F sharp, E, E, and then B, F sharp, E, F sharp, F sharp, okay? Whoops, there's no two F sharp at the end, that's for the next part, but yeah, do it again. So, B, E, F sharp, E, E, B, F sharp, E, F sharp, okay? The next F sharp, I played it by accident because that's actually for the fourth and last part. Anyway, so that's it for the right hand. Uh, left hand, same as the first part, it's just A major, A, C sharp, E, and C sharp minor, which is C sharp, E, G sharp. With those two chords in mind, A major and C sharp minor, let's put the two hands together, it goes like this, okay? So, this time, A major starts first, and right hand comes in. Right hand comes in. Second E and C sharp minor together. Like that. Okay, kind of different this time, okay, for the hands together and stuff, okay? So, here, two, three, two, three, together, two. That's the third part, okay? Now moving on to the fourth and last part of the chorus. Right hand, it goes to what I did before by accident. It's the F sharp, and then it goes two F sharps, and then E, and then F sharp, E, F sharp, A, G sharp, E. Kind of like an extension to the um, second part, okay? So it's similar to the second part you can hear, but just extra note on the second half of the phrase. Anyway, so let's do it again. The fourth part for this goes F sharp, 
and then F sharp, F sharp, E, and then F sharp, E, F sharp, A, G sharp, E, like that. Yeah. Okay, so just like that. And the left turn really easy, just two B major chords. B major and B major. Okay, so with that in mind, let's put the sound together for this part. So it goes F sharp and B major together. And F sharp and B major together. Like that. Okay, that's the fourth part. Let's do it again. So it goes together, two, three. So that's it for the fourth part. Okay, so I think we have some extra time left. So I might as well just teach you the drop section as well, right after the chorus. Okay, it goes like. Essence is kind of like this um, thing times two times, same motive times twice, and then the ending half of it for each of those uh, times that we play the motive, it's the kind of the same motive as the ending of the uh, second and fourth part of the chorus that we just learned. But anyway, so let's learn it. Right hand, really simple. Goes C sharp, the high C sharp, so middle C, 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 C sharp here, okay? So B, G sharp, and then it goes B. E, and then here's the second half of the motif. It goes F sharp B, e, F sharp A, G sharp E. Okay, let's do it again, right hand. So it goes C sharp, B, G sharp, and then B, and then down to E, and then the motif. E, F sharp B, e, F sharp A, G sharp E. Okay, that's the right hand. You play that for a total of two times. Okay, you repeat that. But anyway, so the left hand, there's four chords here. It's the same four chords that we learned for the first and second part of the chorus, which is A major. C sharp minor and B major and B major. Those four chords in that series, okay? So you know it already because we just learned it from the chorus. So A major, C sharp minor, B major, B major. With those four chords in mind, let's put the two hands together for this um, kind of drop part, okay? C sharp and A major chord together. G sharp and C sharp minor together. And then B and B major together. And then F sharp and B major together. Like that, okay? So let's do one more time. So it goes together. Total times play it for twice, okay? Anyway, so after the drop, it goes back to the chorus, which you know already, which is, yeah, so you can just add up and add up so it's just improvisational stuff to make it more fun. So, for example, the chorus, make it bigger. Have fun with it. I guess the 6 8 improvisation is a bit harder because you're more limited, you're more counting uh, closely to the 6 8 instead of trying to improvise something. So just, um, I guess, be mindful when you're trying to improvise in 6 8. So don't go too crazy, I guess. <laughs> Because you don't want to go suddenly into like 4-4 four, four because that's changed the whole rhythm. So it's like one, two, three, like that's wrong already because you need to know where to match the rhythm, okay? So it's just one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, like that. Always count the six, eight, like the six beats in the whole like rhythm thing because like you don't want to get like messed up with the improvisation just because you couldn't count properly with the 6-8 rhythm, okay? But anyway, keep that in mind throughout the whole song when you're trying to play the song. 6-8 rhythm, count 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, or you can count 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 1, same thing, but just keep that in mind when you're doing it and you'll be all good. Okay, so I hope you enjoy learning this song. Enjoy my cover for this song. I did the full version of it, including like the pretty awesome intro. <laughs> part okay and all the the verse and the pretty nice verse the kind of march kind of verse pretty awesome and then also the chorus and everything and the ending and stuff but anyway check that out i've done also a lot of other anime opening songs and ending songs you can check it out in the description below in the playlist but anyway that's for now go check out all my other covers and tutorials on my channel i have so many tutorials and covers for you to learn and enjoy from i have like over 1000 for you to enjoy but anyway as for now enjoy your time around my channel and i guess see you next time 
Hello guys, as a reward for watching my video right to the end, here is what I have for you. If you want to learn how I can play any song in the world, including this one in this video within 10 to 20 minutes just by listening, then click the first link in the description below to preview my ear mastery book for free. Click the second link for my beginner's course if you are completely new to the piano and don't know where to start. Click the third link for my library of popular full song video lessons membership. Or click the fourth link for my paid piano request and full song tutorial service if you want me to personally play any song for you or make a full song tutorial for you. And finally, if you are a sheet music learner who wants to learn a specific song or arrangement where the sheet music is not available anywhere in the world, then click the fifth link for my sheet music transcription service where I will personally write it out for you. As for now, like this video, subscribe, enjoy your time around my channel and see you next time.